Hi, I'm Bhaskar Amarthi, a researcher at Willow Garage, and last week I was a member of a team working on our second hackathon. The goal of the hackathon was to have the robot push a wheeled cart around the building, gather used coffee cups and bottles, and transport them to the kitchen to be washed. Navigating while pushing a cart presents several new challenges. First, the cart occludes the area in front of the robot from the sensors, thus limiting visibility. Second, uh, the default planning algorithm we use works best for approximately circular robots, but less well when the robot is navigating tight spaces while pushing a cart. The robot must detect cups and bottles in its environment and further decide which ones need to be cleaned and don't contain liquids, which would be unsafe for the robot to pick up. We used a human-in-the-loop approach to solve the perception problem. When the robot reaches a table, it takes an image of the scene and sends it to a human operator who could be remote. The human operator draws a box around the object that needs to be picked up next and sends it back. The robot then figures out the 3D position of this object and calls the grasping pipeline, which actually picks up the object and then brings it back to the cart. Our overall system contains several components working together, such as navigation, perception, and manipulation. To coordinate all of these, we use SMASH, which stands for State Machine. As the name suggests, SMASH allows defining state machines and also defining uh, failure recovery behaviors and visualizing execution. We believe that pushing around carts, wheelchairs, and other wheeled objects is an extremely useful capability of autonomous robots in home and office settings. What we've done this last week represents a first step towards a solution, and we plan to continue working to make this a robust capability of our robot.